Hi, I'm Bob Ryan. This is Glove 10.0. With me today is Joe Sullivan. Joe, Giants were 7-7, seven and seven, and you know what uh, you were hearing from some segments of the fans, not necessarily the media, but the fans. Fire Coughlin. I mean, come on. Let, 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 can, we, can we give the man his due, huh? Well, he's in the second Super Bowl, and he certainly has uh, won a lot more than he's lost, and he's proven he's a championship coach. But I think if you look at the Giants roster, it's viewed as a talented roster. And they've just been wildly inconsistent they have been. during the regular season. And when you're in a place like New York, I mean, it, 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 it's, it's like Boston. If you're not delivering the goods, and they didn't appear to be earlier this season, well, then that, that's the type of talk that's going to go around. What's happened, for those of you who weren't paying attention to the Giants after, you know, if you went to a show after uh, 19, uh, 2008, is that that in, in the years 2009 and 10 and 11, the Giants had second half collapses. Yes. And they were on the verge of another one with four straight losses to drop them to 7-7 seven and seven before they launched their big push for the playoffs, and mm -hmm. here they are now. So you can understand that. That's what it's all about. Those collapse more than anything. It's yeah. those collapses they had the three previous years for which he was going to be held accountable. But also this year, they were they were incredibly inept in two big games. Then when they played New Orleans and Green <sighs> yeah. Bay, and, and uh, Green Bay in terms defensively, they, they played well offensively against Green Bay. They gave up like over 1,100 yards in two games. Uh, you know, I can't remember the point totals, but it was really poor. And then they had a loss at home to Seattle. They lost to the Redskins. And they lost to the Redskins uh. twice. No, twice. Yeah, you know. These are the things to get coaches right. fired, but he, he you know, has saved it again, Bob. He's, yeah, he's got his image. His image is, is still poor. His body language is hilarious. I think he has the greatest look of exasperation, <laughs> I've ever, I, even when they're winning, that I've ever seen. I love him. You know, and, but the fact is that he's not the same guy that was at BC, and he's not the same guy that was with the Giants yeah. up to 2007. Yeah. He tried desperately to humanize himself with the team, and I think, by and large, that has been successful. Yeah, and, and the, the reports we're getting out of New York is this team really does love Coughlin. Really? As a person, I'm buying as a it. Coach, and they want to win for him. I'm that, buying that, it. That's what the Pelers are saying. So there you go. And by the way, well, one more time, thank you for beating Notre Dame.